Today we will discuss about static and dynamic retinoscopy. The word static and dynamic indicate the state of accommodation of our eyes whether accommodation is in static condition or dynamic condition. Now you might be thinking what is static condition and dynamic condition? Well, static condition means relaxed position of accommodation or zero amplitude of accommodation and dynamic condition means accommodation is in active mode or having amplitude of accommodation. If we consider accommodation as a person then the static condition means the accommodation is at sitting position or having a rest in his bed and dynamic condition means the accommodation is working or running. Now let's see what is static retinoscopy. Static retinoscopy is the condition where the refraction is done when accommodation is relaxed. Relaxation of accommodation is done by asking the patient to look at an object at 6 meter or far or using cycloplasic eye drop, atropine, cyclopentolate, etc. It can be done in two ways dry retinoscopy and wet retinoscopy. I will prepare a separate video on dry and wet retinoscopy. In static retinoscopy, we can identify emetropia and emetropia like myopia, hyperopia and astigmatism. Now what is dynamic retinoscopy? Dynamic retinoscopy is the condition where refraction is done when accommodation is in active mode to check whether the amplitude of accommodation is normal or not. Activation of accommodation is done by asking the patient to look at any near object situated less than 6 meter. Most used dynamic retinoscopies are monocular estimated method, bell retinoscopy, knots retinoscopy. In dynamic retinoscopy, we can identify leg and lead of accommodation. I will prepare a separate video on leg and lead of accommodation. Till then, stay with us.